Okay guys, a uh, quick tutorial, going to show you how to add a message window to the start of your build. Um, first off, you're going to need the files. Uh, group page, under files, you will see autoexec.py and script.codihelp.popup.zip. Download both of these, you need them both. Okay, so you should grab them, you've got them, so we can launch Kodi. And we can install the zip file first. So install from zip Windows. Enabled, good, and we will come out of Kodi. And open up our build. So inside your app data, you will have usual files we want to first I'll show you there it is Kodi this is script .kodi help but right open it up now this add-on.py if you will right click uh, right click edit with notepad plus plus so now this is the part you need to edit now you can write what you like in there keep it between the marks keep the marks we need those but you can change the text do exactly as it says we can write anything we want here disclaimer warning whatever so write what you want in there click save and then we need to go uh, back back right now now user data we're gonna open it up I'm gonna minimize that for a minute now we need to open there. Uh, the second file that you downloaded, it was this one here, autoexec.py. So I'm just going to drag that, drop that in there. That's in there. Right. That's all we need to do. That is it. We'll close that down. Next time I launch Cody. Here it is. We have a little window. <laughs> now, this, you can use this as a standard format, just like I've put here, so you can add it to your build. Now, write whatever you want in there, obviously, change it to do whatever. Now, if you want to take it a step further, you can put this add-on inside a repository. Install from the repository and add the PY to your build as well, the autoexec.py to your build as well. Now, once you have that in place, you can then edit this message whenever you want. So if you've updated your build, for instance, you can edit that message to say, update of this build is available. Please download or re-download wizard again. You can write whatever you like, but the point is, it's quite a cool little thing to have at the front of your build. You can, well, you can get, a, get any message you want across. Now, a lot of people want to, you know, use RSS feeds, which is great, but I find people turn them off because they get, a little bit annoying to certain people. I myself never have them on. I hate them. But it's a good way of getting a message across. But this is just gonna, so, you know, it can be quite annoying. I guess it will annoy people eventually. But hey, it's your message, and you want to put it across into your build. So it's tough, isn't it? And it's a cool little way to, like, say, get updates out. You can notify people of updates. So I hope you like the video. I hope you use the add-on. Uh, if you get stuck, give us a shout on the page.